All right, I'm here with Jordan, and Jordan and I are going to teach you how to convert decimal measurement right now. So we have these conversions where it's a larger, you know, you got these big decimal on here, right? So you don't know how to remember how to do this. Well, what if it was said three kilograms equals how many grams? What would you do? You have to know how many grams are in a... Do you know how many grams are in a kilogram? How many? A thousand. Good. So there's a thousand grams in a kilogram. So what would you do if it just said three? Three kilograms equals how many grams? What would the answer be? Zero. The answer would be zero? But you said there were a thousand grams in a kilogram. So if I have one kilogram, mm -hmm. the answer is going to be what? One kilogram equals how many grams? You just told me. A thousand. So two kilograms equals two thousand. So three kilograms equals what am I actually doing? Multiplying it by a thousand. So I'm taking this times a thousand and it gives me that, right? Okay. So the same thing. You just multiply three point four five six times a thousand. 3.456 times 1,000. Now, that's a very easy problem, right? All I'm really doing is multiplying 3.456 times 1 mm -hmm. and then sticking three zeros after it. But then i got to move the decimal point over three spots, right? So my answer is going to come out to be 3, 4, 5, 6 with three zeros after it. And then you got to move the decimal point over three spots for the three spots here. Mm -hmm. Okay, so the answer is 3,456. Now, what do you notice between this number and that answer? Just the decimal. You just that's all. You just moved the decimal. What did you do? Moved it over three. Just moved it over three spots to get the answer. So, what are you going to do on this one? Move it over three spots. So let's try that. 7.2 7, to 3. Decimal there, I got some blank spots to put zeros in. 7,200. Get it? Yeah. That's the end.